Hello guys, how you doing? This is su amigo Alex, your friend Alex. And today I'm going to try to move my WhatsApp from the iPhone to an Android device. This is a Motorola with Android 11. Let me show you the model. So this is the Motorola One 5G Ace Android 11. Let's see here. It says Motorola One 5G setup in process. So click there, finish Motorola setup. And then we're going to click start. I always reset the Android device in order to move WhatsApp from iPhone to Android. But in this case, I finished a simple setup. It's still asking me to finish the setup. So that's why I'm going to be able to do this. Copy apps and data. All right. So this is the important part, guys. Copy apps and data. You can choose to transfer your apps, photos, contacts, Google account, and more. So I'm going to click next. And it says, bring your data from a backup from the cloud or an iPhone device. Oh, look at this. Copy your data. Follow these steps. Open Safari. Go to Android Switch. Follow the instructions. So this is pretty much not allowing me to do the cable to cable, you know. And I think this is because this is Android 11. So let me try with an Android 12 phone. I have here a Samsung Galaxy A12, Android version 12, okay. So on this one, I already set up the phone. It says complete setup by installing apps. So finish setting up your Galaxy. Let's see if it gives me any. Yeah, right there. Finally, we are here. Copy apps and data. I'm going to click next. Use another device. Okay, next. The whole thing is done by Smart Switch. Select a source. So I'm going to click iPhone. Get connected. You know, using a cable is fastest and lets you transfer more data. So I'm going to use a cable. I need a lighting cable from my iPhone to USB-C for my Android. So let's see what happened. Connecting to transfer your data. Tap trust on the pop-up message. Trust this computer, trust. Okay, and then click next. Searching for data to transfer. All right, look at this, 10 selected. Calls and contacts, messages, apps, data, all this stuff. So what I want to transfer is, oh, look at the apps, click on apps. If I click apps, it should show me what's up. I don't know why it's not doing it. All right, so I'm just going to click contacts and apps. Transfer. Let's see if it's going to transfer what's up. Yeah, right there. Eight selected. What's up messenger, music, Microsoft. So I'm going to deselect all this. And the only one I'm going to install is what's up messenger. And you're going to click install. But here you can see that it's only 90 megabytes. Okay install transfer whatsapp chats scan the qr code with your iphone to open whatsapp then tap start with my camera app it's not doing it oh right there open in whatsapp and here it says move chats to android transfer your chat history and media to your new android phone so we're gonna click start continue on your new phone Keep the cable connected. Now it says continue on your new phone. Looks like it's done, right? Sometimes we have it right here. Uh, right there, guys, look. Installing apps. Transferring. Look at this transferring. Smart switch transferring. One minute left. Looks like it finished. Organizing your transfer data. Smart switch also. Okay, so you have to be patient, guys. Data transfer complete, it says. Tap here to see the results. So we're going to click there. Installing apps. I think it's going to install the WhatsApp from here. Yeah, right here. Right? You see? 168 megabytes. So let's open this one. Open. And hopefully we're going to see the transfer on this one. Okay, the phone number, we're going to use the same phone number that we use here. And that is 786-947-7210. Make sure it's correct. And yes, I should get a text here. Use your other phone to confirm moving WhatsApp to this one. Let's click here, cancel transfer. And that's the code that I need, 948-692. And that should do it. Verify it. Contacts and media, continue. Your phone number is not longer registered. Okay, so here I'm going to put allowed, allowed. And here it is, guys, importing chat history. We need permissions to restore your chats. So start. Oh, it's important right now, 20%. It's going fast. In your case, guys, this might take a while because you're going to have a lot of data. Importing, import complete, next. And then they keep my avatar. So I'm just going to put Alex. 
now it's connecting all right guys so after another five minutes look at this google storage backup i'm going to include videos select daily and now we have to select a google account and i'm going to select this one my track phone wireless at gmail.com so by doing that now i'm going to be sure that i'm going to have a backup on google drive for android i used to have it on icloud now i'm going to have it on google drive let's see um continue including videos daily to this account i'm going to click done and this is my WhatsApp, guys. And this is my chats. And here are all my chats. All the chats that I used to have on the iPhone now are here. And this is the biggest one. Let's check that one. Yep. That's it. I have everything here, guys. Word documents, emojis, emojis, pictures, videos. Let's play a video. Yeah, it's working. Okay, so it was 100% successful, guys. I moved everything from my iPhone 13 to my Samsung Galaxy A12 with Android 12. That concludes the tutorial on how to move your WhatsApp chat data from iPhone to Android. And we already confirmed that you need Android 12 in order to do this because we tried with this Motorola with Android 11 and it didn't work. Thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. That's the best way you can support what I do, guys. So I can continue doing videos for you. If you have any questions, please let me know in the comments. I will try to answer and I'll see you on my next video. Take care, guys. Bye.